you think God is not doing enough. There are times when you're giving makes you think it's not enough. There are times when you're loving makes you love less. But then there is nothing like worship. When worship is worship. Now, I have come to the place of realizing that the mysterious key to open God's heart of love is worship. Because, God bless you. because we live in times that we have preachers. Yet people have needs. We live in times we have prayer warriors. People can pray and the earth will quake. It is because the earth obeyed their prayer and not because God enjoyed their worship. But when it comes to worship, the earth may not respond to your needs. But heaven will provide your needs. So worship is not a thing to fight or militate against things of the world. But worship is a thing to pollute, to turn around, and to create an uncomfortable atmosphere for God to look down and say, come on, I can't shut up again. Worship is when, even in your sleep, God will say, I've got to protect him because if I don't protect him, tomorrow there will be no food for him. I have come to the place of realizing that every minute of my life should be a moment of worship. Have you asked yourself that as a child of God, if you fail to worship God, then God will wish Satan was still there. If worship was not that important, he wouldn't have said that if we will not worship him, he will command stones. So that, that's how important worship is. And do you know what happens to a non-worshipping Christian? Then God is telling you, even the stone, the non-living thing, is more important than you are. You want to know your worth in the sight of God? Give him worship. You want to know your value? Give him worship. Ask yourself in the book of Job, the chapter number one, Bible says God had a moment with his children. I don't know the name of the party they were having, but Bible says they all came. But God couldn't notice any of them. But then all of a sudden, Bible says, and God noticed Satan. What did the guy do? What kind of worship? Now, if you are watching us right now on YouTube, maybe with your husband, your wife, your family, why don't you just hold your hands and just give it all to him? Come will know that this 
is the person in the picture. So worship is your artistic imprint of your God on a paper to show to the world that this is the nature. This is how beautiful. This is how great. This is how awesome. This is how marvelous the God is. This week, as you watch this worship, say to yourself, in the morning I will worship Him. In the afternoon I will worship Him. In the evening I will worship Him. Even in my sleep, I will worship Him. And as you keep worshiping the Lord, may He show you His glory. Myself and this beautiful family will want to say, when you pray, God will send an angel. But when you worship, He will come Himself. Remember, 